This is a rotary evaporator which we use to remove solvents at a lower temperature than they would normally boil at atmospheric pressure. We do this by applying a reduced pressure to the system. We're going to put our flask on here and secure it with a clip. When we apply the reduced pressure the solvent is going to boil. The vapours will condense out on the condenser and drip down into the receiving flask. Some solvents like diethyl ether or dichloromethane might not condense out. Before you start using the rotary evaporator, make sure the waste solvent bulb is empty. First thing to do is turn the water aspirator on. This is going to apply reduced pressure to the aspirator. You also need to turn the condenser tap on. Close the tap at the top and slowly start to rotate the flask while supporting it with your hand. Listen for a change in the sound of the aspirator. This means there's sufficient force to hold the flask in place. Then lower the flask into the water bath. If you're removing a solvent like diethyl ether or dichloromethane, don't turn the water bath on. Once all the solvent has gone, open the tap. and turn the rotation off. When you've finished, remember to empty the solvent waste into an appropriate solvent waste bottle.